Howdy folks, Wild Bill here for Umatilla County Search and Rescue. I'm down here at the SAR barn doing a quick little ad here, what we're going to talk about. You know, when you join Search and Rescue, you got to do a lot of training. But some of it is pretty technical and real high-end stuff. Wanted to show you just a little bit of that right now. Well, hey, Bill. Come on in. Howdy. Hey, Bill. Dan Gardner. This is Dan Gardner, folks. He's our rope team coordinator. I want you to tell him just a little bit, Dan, about what it takes to be a rope team coordinator and what it takes just to get on the rope team in the first place. What's well, about? Sure. Well, as a rope team coordinator, there's some extra training that goes into, that's involved on top of our standard search training. You have to go through a certification process. It's about a four day course usually, which gives you the basics of what to do with the equipment that you have here, how to employ it in the field. And then on top of that, you just have to stay more vigilant in your training and uh, spend some extra time keeping yourself familiar with the different systems, how to operate them and how to employ them in the field. So this is one of our uh, favorite pieces of equipment. This is our CMC clutch. We can use it to uh, raise or lower a load. And there's tons of different options that we can use with that. We have pulleys to make a mechanical advantage, press it cord if we need to arrest something. Arrest is the wrong word. If we need to stop something, we can use our press it cord, various carabiners to attach, ropes, slings, and webbing. Lots of equipment that goes into this and lots of training. And you, you, can, uh, you can affect a rescue from anywhere from just helping someone up a steep slope to a complete vertical pole, lifting someone immobilized in a litter, usually with a rescue attendant, keeping that litter straight as they go up the hill. We can do it all with this equipment we have here and the training that we get to go through. All right, outstanding, Dan, appreciate that. Sure. You know, folks, wanna see you there. We got an upcoming event and uh, be looking forward to seeing you at the end of this month. Thanks a lot, this is Wild Bill saying goodbye. Dan? Thanks guys, have a good evening.